Hello, everybody. I'm Henry Lee, BlueHeronArts.com. We're now going to do a special name seal for Stacy Mills. Um, Stacy, which is a male name in this case, uh, I need to know some personal uh, traits if you want me to translate your name, including your. Uh, male, female, or uh, what kind of style of art. So in this case, Stacy is um, a Sumi or Chinese brush painting artist who liked detailed artworks, uh, detailed painting. So I designed this seal. Uh, this is the stone he picked. It's a round-shaped stone. Normally, the seal is in um, square shape, but uh, um, you can also do an oval or uh, round shape. And uh, we have designed several uh, styles in different uh, carving, uh, negative or positive. And this is the one he picked. Actually, this is the only one I uh, made uh, uh, adjustment to the shape. You can see in the uh, computer screen, I will show you. And uh, now I'm going to carve. So I did a uh, transfer uh, with the help of this uh, liquid called the Aston. Um, you can get from hardware stores or nail polish supply stores. And uh, so now it's a uh, flipped image. A mirror image on the stone. So I will carve with a. Uh, I would like to use a regular size, uh, medium sized knife. I start from the character Mao. Uh, he translated into a Chinese his name Mao. Uh, that's the family name, based on and the letter M in Muse, and uh, the, f um, the other two characters is uh, Shu, means art. The first character in uh, for given name, and uh, um, Tian means quiet or peaceful. And we always add a fourth character to make it uh, official or in you know, the name seal. Uh, it's the character seal. We use the knife as if the brush, we call it iron brush, uh, to simulate the calligraphic strokes. So they're not even knives, they're subtle uh, lifting and pressing. are not even, so the line uh, also has this, uh, we call it ancient look, antique look. That's the beauty of uh, this kind of art. It's not mechanical, like a computer font.
I actually I jump to the third character. It depends on the convenience. You don't have to follow exactly the writing order. Next character is Shu, means uh, skill or art. See, I actually turn the stone instead of the knife. I like do the curve. Okay, last character is uh, Yin. Yin is a um, common character used in addition to the names, so it reads the seal of someone, or someone's seal. Um, it's a very common practice to add this character into the, the design of name seals. We often see this, and I was asked one day by a customer, what does the uh, EP mean? Uh, the seal, in Chinese, re uh, write this way. So, it reads in. Let me write the whole thing here. Mao, that's the last name, comes first, and uh, Su, Art, and Tian, Tian means uh, uh, quiet, quiet. <coughs> so I'm working on this fourth character.
No, is the most tricky part actually the round uh, margin. It's very hard to do. Okay, I didn't break the edge, that's the challenge. Sometimes it's okay to chip it and um, see uh, how I can uh, do it as a whole. Then we will adjust according to the situation. Um, since Stacy likes the uh, kind of neat art, so I try to do it in a very neat, slick style. Okay, now I will um, <coughs> just make the, the edge a little round, so it will not be so hard. it and uh, come back to make an impression. Okay, now I have uh, cleaned up and I uh, want to see how we're doing so far. So I'm going to make a step.
perfect to me already. Um, I like the rhythm, you know, the <coughs> this thing and the, um, the thick uh, flow of the uh, energy and just a little bit adjustment maybe on certain parts. Okay, I think uh, it's done. I'm going to make an official impression now. Press straight down and easily lift it carefully. Okay, let's make another official copy for Stacy. Perfect. That's the perfect copy. Okay. I um, I like to thank uh, Stacy Mills, Mr. Stacy Mills, for your commissioning of doing this uh, name seal, and I really enjoyed it. I hope everybody on YouTube also enjoy watching it. Uh, if you like to order your own name seal. Please contact me at blueheronarts.com. Goodbye.